one. Good evening. It is 732 on Monday, March 23rd. This is a meeting of the Building Utilities Committee. I'm Zachary Allen, Chair of the Committee. Uh, we have Mr. Twiss to my right, Mr. Terwilliger to my left, the other committee members. And we are here to read a request for additional authorization, rebuilding parts and screen number two at the wastewater treatment plant. Mr. Titterington. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Um, on February 3rd, Council authorized us to bid uh, that project, which is rebuilding the, uh, uh, the, second, uh, the second screen um, at the wastewater treatment plant. We asked for an authorization not to exceed $100,000. Uh, we recently uh, opened sealed bids, um, and uh, two, we received two bids both of which were above the authorized amount. Um, Dahl Lehman of Tip City provided the lowest and best bid of uh, slightly under $110,000. Um, the fact of the matter is that 80% uh, of the bid is a material cost, um, which uh, if you look at the line above it, that doesn't make sense. It, it is 80% of the uh, of the bid. The, this bid represents $88,000 in material and 21.7 in labor expense. That's what that should say. Um, and so, we really don't believe we're going to get any better bids out of this because materials are materials. They're only going to go up in price. Um, and so, we are asking that you increase the authorization to 115 so that we have a slight contingency in case some adjustments need to be made on site. Um, we do have the funds in uh, the sewer fund for, uh, for the additional $15,000. On, on a bid like this, is there typically, uh, do they list like how many employee hours or length of time they expect a job to be completed? Uh, they usually have an, uh, a length of time uh, included in bids. Now, given the, uh, atmosphere. Mm -hmm. um, several of our contracts have asked if, if we had any flexibility on the time. Uh, and, and I don't believe, I, I don't believe we've told any of them no. Um, so, you know, I'm not sure about the, the time itself. Um, and I will say that we are also, we're asking for emergency legislation because we've got to get this project started. We didn't anticipate an overage. So if we can get emergency legislation, that would be appreciated. Mm -hmm. Is 80-20 a typical like uh, ratio that you look for on a bid, or is it yeah, different? Material to labor? Yeah. No, it, it, it can vary. There are some projects that may be heavier on the labor side. Um, many of them come back at about 50-50. Okay. Just depends on what the uh, project is. Okay. Gentlemen, questions? I don't have any questions. This is screen number two. So there was a screen one. There is. Was that last year replaced, fixed? Um, I'm not sure if we've uh, we've fixed that one yet. Okay. We just call it number two. It may be the first one installed, or it may be just the one that needs to be uh, replaced now. I feel like he said this is uh, this one needs replaced first, and that still has a couple of years. Or yeah, if I remember correctly. I think you're right. Any other questions, staff? Council members? Move forward with Move emergency. Forward. Move forward. Okay. All right. Move Thank forward. you. Anything else before us tonight? No, sir. All right. 